Hello, I'm Aruna and welcome to Target Yoga. Today it's week 4 of my Slow and Basic Yoga for Senior series. Today it's a complete body stretch at a slow pace. And if you've missed the previous sessions, you can grab the links to those in the video description below. Let's start. Let's start by sitting in a comfortable cross-legged position with your thumbs and index fingers touching in Chin Mudra and place your palms upwards on your knees. Close your eyes as we practice some abdominal breathing. Inhale through your nose and expand your abdomen. Exhale through your nose and contract your abdomen. Inhale, expand your abdomen. Exhale, contract your abdomen. Inhale, expand your abdomen. Exhale, contract your abdomen. Open your eyes. Inhale and raise your arms up your sides to the sky, palms meeting, and look up. Exhale and bend your elbows to chest level, draw your arms back, squeeze your shoulder blades together, and extend your chest forwards, stretching your fingers. Inhale, raise your arms sideways and up to the sky and look up. Exhale and bend your elbows to chest level. Draw your arms back. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Extend your chest forwards and stretch your fingers. Inhale, raise your arms sideways and up to the sky and look up. Exhale and lower your arms. Relax. Now stretch your arms out in front of you. Interlock your fingers and turn your palms out. Inhale and raise your hands over your head. Exhale, bend to your left, keeping your arms by your ears and your head in a neutral position. Inhale and release the stretch, returning to center. Exhale and bend to the right. Again, keep your arms by your ears and your head in a neutral position. Inhale and release the stretch. Lower your arms and relax. Now make your way onto your hands and knees for some cat-cow stretches. Place your wrists under your shoulders and your knees under your hips. Inhale, tilt your tailbone up Drop your belly and look up. Exhale, round your spine, tuck your navel in and drop your head to your chest. Inhale, tilt your tailbone up, drop your belly down and look up. Exhale, round your spine, tuck your navel in and drop your head to your chest. Inhale, tilt your tailbone up, drop your belly down and look up. Exhale, round your spine, tuck your navel in and drop your head to your chest. Come into a neutral position and relax. 
Keep your head in a neutral position and tuck your toes in. Engage your navel and lift your knees off the floor so they are hovering just above the floor. Keep pulling your navel in, breathe normally and hold your position. Lower your knees to the floor and take a breath. Engage your navel and lift your knees to hover just above the floor. Keep pulling your navel in, breathe normally and hold your position. Lower your knees to the floor and relax. Inhale, move your palms forwards a few inches and tuck your toes in. Exhale and lift your knees off the floor. Shift your weight back as you lift your hips back and up, coming into the downward facing dog pose. Keep your head in between your arms and stretch your arms and your chest towards your legs. Breathe normally. Walk on the spot, slowly stretching one heel down, followed by the other. Now come up to stand on the balls of your feet. And now stretch your heels down as much as possible. Come up on the balls of your feet and stretch your heels down. Stand on the balls of your feet and stretch your heels down. Slowly bend your knees and lower your knees to the floor. Relax. Moving into a low lunge, step forwards with your right leg in between your palms with your knee stacked over the ankle. Drop your left knee to the floor and stretch your leg back to a comfortable distance. Place your left foot on the floor, toes pointing away. It doesn't matter how far back your left leg is. Just flow with your body limits. Push your hips forwards and look forwards. Now grip the mat with your toes and raise your body upright with your arms by your sides. And now slowly raise your arms to the front and up, palms facing each other and fingers stretched. And if you're stable, look up at your fingers. Lower your gaze and slowly lower your arms to the front and down. Lean forwards and place your palms on either side of your right foot. Inhale and raise your right arm to the side and up. Twist your body to the right and look up at your fingers. Exhale, release the twist and lower your arm, placing your palm back on the floor. Slowly take your right leg back, returning to tabletop pose. Step forwards and place your left leg in between your palms with your knee stacked over the ankle. Drop your right knee to the floor and stretch it back to a comfortable distance. Place your right foot on the floor, toes pointing away. Again, it doesn't matter how far back your right leg is. Just mind your body limits. Push your hips forwards and look forwards. Grip the mat with your toes and raise your body upright with your arms by your sides. 
And now slowly raise your arms to the front and up, palms facing each other and fingers stretched. And when you're stable, look up at your fingers. Slowly lower your gaze and lower your arms to the front and down. Lean forwards and place your palms on either side of your right foot. Inhale and raise your left arm sideways and up. Twist your body to the left and look up at your fingers. Exhale, release the twist and lower your arm, placing your palm back on the floor. Slowly take your left leg back, returning to tabletop pose. Lift your knees off the floor and walk your hands to your feet. Keeping your knees bent, hold the opposite elbow and gently sway your body from side to side as you relax. Now keep your body still and nod your head. And now sway your head from side to side. Now keep your head still and lower your hands to the floor. Inhale and keeping your knees bent, Raise your arms and body leading from your hips, not your back, into an upright position. Exhale and lower your arms. Relax. Face the long side of your mat. Take a big step out to a comfortable distance, around three to four feet apart, with your toes pointing in front. Inhale, raise your arms sideways, parallel to the floor, palms facing down. Turn your left foot 90 degrees to the left and turn the right foot slightly in. Now turn your head to the left and look at your fingers. Exhale and bend your left knee, taking care not to extend the knee beyond the ankle. Keep your knee in line with the second toe to prevent it from falling in and keep your body upright. If you are stable, you can refine the pose by sliding your back foot backwards to deepen the stance. If you can't, just remain where you are. Inhale and straighten your leg. Turn your head and your left foot back to face front. Exhale and lower your arms. Inhale, raise your arms sideways, parallel to the floor, palms down. Turn the right foot 90 degrees to the right. Turn the left foot slightly in and turn your head to the right and look at your fingers. Exhale and bend your right knee, taking care not to extend the knee beyond the ankle. Keep the knee in line with the second toe to prevent it from falling in and keep your body upright. And if you're stable, you can refine the pose by sliding your back foot backwards to deepen the stance. And if you can't, it doesn't matter, just remain where you are. Inhale and straighten the right leg and turn your head and right foot back to face front. Exhale and lower your arms to your sides. Heel toe in.
Inhale and raise your arms sideways and up to the sky, palms meeting. Exhale, bend your knees and fold forwards from your hips and place your fingers on the floor. Let your head hang loose. Slowly come onto all fours. Swing your legs to one side and lower your hips to the floor, coming into a seated position with your legs outstretched in the staff pose. Now draw your feet in so your soles meet as we move into the bound angle pose. Try to bring your feet in as close as possible to your torso. Keep your back straight. Interlock your fingers and cup your toes or hold your ankles. Inhale, open your chest and lengthen your spine. Exhale, tilt your pelvis forwards and bend forwards from your hips to your maximum stretch. Breathe normally. It doesn't matter if you can't bend forwards much, just listen to your body and do what you can. Inhale and slowly straighten your body leading from the hips. Exhale, tilt your pelvis forwards and fold forwards from your hips. Inhale and straighten your body leading from the hips. Relax. Now come onto all fours, the tabletop pose, with your wrists under your shoulders and your knees under your hips. Walk your arms out, stretching your arms and your body forwards. Place your forehead on the floor and keep your elbows off the floor as you come into the puppy pose. Stretch your hips up and back behind you. Breathe normally. Now place your forearms on the floor. Raise your forehead off the floor and shift your weight forwards as you lower your hips to the floor. Rest your forehead on the floor and place your palms down on the floor beside your chest. Keep your elbows close to your body. Engage your legs and press the tops of your feet to the floor. Inhale and raise your head, chest and upper abdomen off the floor. Exhale as you release the stretch. Engage your legs and press the tops of your feet to the floor. Inhale, raise your head, chest and upper abdomen off the floor. Exhale as you release the stretch. Push down with your palms and raise your body to come back onto all fours. Bring your heels together and part your knees to a comfortable distance. And then sit back on your heels, stretch your arms and your body out on the floor and rest your forehead on the floor. Slowly draw your body back, bring your knees together and lift your hips off the floor. 
Swing your legs to one side and lower your hips to the floor. Bend your knees and rest your feet on the floor. Hold your thighs and slowly lower your body to the floor as you slide your hands down your legs. Now lift your feet off the floor and draw your knees towards your chest. Straighten your lower legs so they are perpendicular to the floor. Hold your soles with your arms on the insides of your legs. And now open your legs out to the sides as we stretch our hips. Breathe normally. Slowly bring your legs together, release your hold and lower your feet to the floor. And then stretch your legs out. Close your eyes as we relax the body. Bring your awareness to your toes and relax your toes. And now move to your feet and relax your feet, your ankles, your knees and thighs. Move your awareness to your hips and your back. Feel the tension dissipate from your hips. And now move your awareness to your abdomen and relax your abdomen. Move your awareness to your arms Relax your arms and relax your fingers. Bring your awareness to your shoulders and your neck and relax them by rolling your head from side to side. Relax your face by parting your lips slightly. Feel your jaw relax and your facial tension release. You are now completely relaxed. And now slowly focus on your breathing. Be aware of your breath slowing down and becoming quieter. Focus on each inhalation and exhalation. Every time you find your thoughts drifting, bring your mind back to your breath. Do this for a while. You may remain here for as long as you like. I will take my leave. Thank you for joining me and I hope to see you soon. Namaste. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe to receive more videos, like and share with those who may benefit from this. Namaste.